Hello everyone and welcome back to Andy's Catholic Book Reviews. In this video I'm going to be doing an unboxing and first impressions of the Baronius Press Dewey Reams Bible Pocket Edition in burgundy leather. So let's get started. So, first of all, I actually got this Bible from Veritatis Publication, uh, Veritatis Publishing. So, let's get to the unboxing. So, I will cut along here and then open it. And then there's an inner box after this cardboard sleeve too. So, So, I cut it, but then I need to I need to remove this I just put my hand on there to rip that and then cut that tape and it is very nice. So it's a pocket Bible, but what you get with Veritatis is another bookmark outside as well as another edition so here's the invoice put that aside and then in this blue bubble wrap you got the bible i don't want to ruin it but here we are so, if we slip the blue bubble wrap off, and then put all the packaging together, then that can be recycled. So, here's the Dewey Reams Pocket Edition, or I should say Compact Edition in burgundy and the features are on the back here so it has a leather bound cover with stitched edges gold gilt head gold gold gilt edged pages and two ribbons which in this one and i think everyone that is made they have blue and red, uh, yellow and red ribbons, so that's that, and then you've got completely retyped set to reproduce the original 1899 edition, making reading much easier. Now if I remember correctly, the Challoner's, Bishop Challoner's edition of the Dewey Reams is um was done in 1752 so this 1899 edition is an american edition i believe i believe bishop chana was british so that's that so there's 30 11 colored maps digitally redrawn 
and fully colored. 32 beautiful engravings that recreate key moments in biblical history. There's a family register section. There's three papal encyclicals regarding the importance of the Holy Bible. And here's the blurb on the back. Catholics looking for the traditional Catholic Bible in English should look no further. The Dewey Reims Bible is an English translation of the Latin Vulgate Bible, a version universally used in the church for over 1500 years, itself meticulously translated from the original Hebrew and Greek by St. Jerome, 340 to 420 AD. In 1546, the Council of Trent declared the Latin Vulgate Bible as authentic and declared that, quotations, no one may dare or presume under any pretext whatsoever to reject it. That's the fourth, from the fourth session, April 8, 1546. In 1943, Pope Pius XII stated that the continuous use of the Vulgate Bible in the church for many centuries showed that it was free from any error quotes free from any error whatsoever in matters of faith and morals divino aflante spiritu 1943 paragraph 21 the revised dewey reims bible has been approved by the church many times over including the approbation of cardinal gibbons for the 1899 edition that Veronius Press is publishing. For over 300 years, the Dewey Reims Bible was the only Catholic English translation of the scripture used. It continues to be used officially in Catholic churches today. Since it was translated quite literally and with great reverence for each individual word from the Vulgate, which in turn reflects the structure of the original languages very clearly. The Dewey Reims Bible can give great insight into the minds of the sacred authors. The notes by Bishop Chalner are entirely faithful to the teachings of the Holy Catholic Church. So let's get to taking the plastic off here. So, what I will do, as to not get into the gold, gold building, I will just cut a few in a few places. Actually, what I will do, I will cut the top bit of plastic that's sticking out here, and then I can go peel it from there. So, then I can take the plastic off and then take this blurb off So, sorry for the lighting. My laptop is out of battery, I think, so sorry for that. But anyway, moving on. The Dewey Reams, it actually feels pretty good. The text size is kind of small. 
but it is readable. So it's like a um, a six point font. I am looking for a leather case for it, actually, or any zippered case for it. So there is the text size. So we have that and here are the some of the images that they're talking about so that's really good and two ribbons So here are the two ribbons, but I think I will actually replace them because they are really thin. They are really thin as you can see. So I think I will do a replacement on them. So. This Bible is pretty awesome. If you have vision, if you have a vision impairment like me, then what you can do is you can get a magnifying glass to read this. So I'm primarily, I primarily bought this so that I can do Bible study. So there's the reviews they have two other colors as well other than this burgundy they have the they have a white and a black so i will link those two as well as this one down below thank you for listening to support me further please like share subscribe comment and god bless thank you